What's happening guys? This is the Grand Master of Faster and welcome back to Let's Play Wario World. Before we get started, please be sure to leave a like or comment below and subscribe to my channel. Every one of those really helps. In this episode, we are going to take on the boss of Thrillsville. From snow, to jungle, to boiling lava. Wow, we're getting confronted by all of the elements, aren't we? The boss of Thrillsville is none other than... The manliest bull in the world! No, not really! This is Red Brief J! As you can see, this guy is rather muscular, and try as you might, your punches and wrestling moves won't do diddly squat against this guy. Uh, watch out for this attack, he's gonna jump high in the air and ground pound. So that just begs the question, how are you supposed to beat this guy if you can't punch him, nor can you use a wrestling move on him? Well, the secret lies in one of his attacks, and that is it. When he dashes, he'll flail on the edge, take the opportunity to ground pound, and knock him into the lava. Yeah, the first time I, I fought this guy, it took me a little while before I figured out what I had to do. And he does get faster every time you damage him. That can be a problem because, as you can see, the platform is not very big. Alright, here's another attack he has. He'll spin in the air to try and dive bomb you. Interestingly, Red Brief J has the most variety of attacks out of all of the bosses in the game. Case in point, he shoots fireballs from his tubes. Okay, there we go. The amount of times he charges equals 6 minus the current HP he has. Uh, we've seen the spin attack, we've seen the dive bomb, we've seen the uh, fireball, and we've seen the uh, giant ground pound. Uh, speaking of ground pound, one piece of advice I want to give you is that when you ground pound him to knock him into the lava, make sure you're on the top of the platform. If you're on the grating, the fire will hurt you as well, and you don't want that to happen. In a way, this uh, boss fight kind of reminds me of a sumo wrestling match. Uh, you, have, you have to knock each other into the lava, and dude, will you please show some originality in your attacks? Okay, one. Oh jeez, he's getting really fast, and presumably angrier as well. Uh, that, oh darn it, I was just a bit too slow. Uh, that's another thing I should mention, is that he doesn't give you as much time to ground pound uh, when he is uh, flailing, the more times he's damaged. Okay, just a couple more dashes, I think that's the last one. There we go! He is done like dinner! So overall, Red Brief J isn't a tough kill, but you do need a lot of patience. And because of that patience, we are rewarded with the third boss key. All 16 treasures, gold fragments, and red diamonds present and accounted for, and all 10 sprightlings rescued. Not too shabby. And that is boss key number three. We've only got one left to collect. And with that, the gate to world four has been opened. So next time on Let's Play Wario World, we are going to tackle world four. Uh, see you guys next time.